Uh, and our second actor tonight is Michael McDonnell. Um, and he's going to be telling us about, or, or showing us, presumably, I don't know, telling us pictures that might just change our life. Um, I mean, that's just Ignite all over, I think. I mean, that's just the entire evening is going to be that. But, you know, this is a specifically chosen check section of them. So, welcome to the stage, Michael McDonnell. Thank you. All right, so I spent about maybe two months coming up with pictures that have some meaning behind them, some important message that I think, well, it's important to me at the time, and I'd like to share them with you. So that's why I put this together. So the first one is about thanking people that have helped you along the way. So when I saw this, I thought, okay, well, everyone wants to achieve something, and nine times out of ten, it's off the back of the people that we've came across, and the experiences that we've had. The second one, which I thought was quite funny at the time, was there's people with umbrellas and there's rain under the umbrella, and the message I got from that was maybe we're creating our own problems, because everyone's put the umbrella up themselves, right? Second one, kept the caption on because wisdom, well, uh, we've got awareness or knowledge is better than age. We've got the child that weighs more than the adult there. I thought it was quite cool. So the next one, I thought it was quite hard hitting for me at the time, because life is this system from life to death at the end. And we've got the guy who clearly not wanting to be any part of that and uh, escaping for his life there. <laughs> so the next one, we've got a journey, so we're on the same journey, could be anything. Someone's looking at the wall, not very happy, and the person on the other side is just changing where they're looking, and they're seeing a sunset, sunrise, and mountains, and enjoying themselves. So it's about being on the same journey. Um, this one is a lot of people chase money, right? So we all have this idea the more money we get, the better we are, until we realize that we get to the end, and we've got all this money with not a lot to do with it. So that was, oh, next one, I love this one. So I'm quite a big reader. I read maybe a, around a book a month, and I've realised that the more that I've read, the more I can see. So there's a wall there, there's read enough books to see over the fence. The next one is about practice. So this one's about no one sees the broken plates, right? No one sees the tries, the failures, the errors. People only see where you're on stage, in the spotlight, not making a mistake. This one was, uh, again, another hard-hitting one for me because I realised that I do this sometimes. I also see people do it themselves. They do things that are good only when there's someone looking. So ask yourself whether you've done that in some time. And this one, again, a lot of people don't. This isn't about loving yourself in terms of a vanity way. This is more of a just don't hate yourself. There's a difference between loving yourself and not hating yourself. Kept the caption up on this one because I think it's important. The world's changed by your example, not your opinion. So everyone sees your actions and follows them rather than the words that you have. This one, uh, I found this, it was in um, a Facebook group that I'm a part of. Basically, it's about just starting. So a lot of the big companies started in sheds and garages. So don't worry about being perfect. Just get things going, and you can improve as you go. This one, this one is, I have a lot of conversations with people that probably disagree with me to a certain extent, right? And it doesn't matter how loud or how long you shout for if you're wrong. So try to make sure that your rationale for doing things makes sense. And this one is, sometimes we hold on to things so tightly that we don't want to let them go, but they're causing more problems than if we just let them go. All right? So this one. Oh, I have, this happens all the time, you know. How are you doing? I'm fine. Secretly, you're not. Oh, yeah. All right, secretly, you've got demons there giving you all kinds of grief, but you just tell people that you're fine just because... Just because you can, it's a way of getting out of having that conversation. This one, I thought, I shared this with a lot of people, and they say that they agree with this one. So when you first start, old you, first arrow does more damage, right? But then as you get older, as you get stronger, you can take more arrows and more hits. This one is a strange one for me with 
ed education being something that I've been through. And there are people that have degrees and PhDs and masters that struggle to get jobs just because it's not as valuable as they first thought. And this one, probably the most important one, is truth in the middle, but you get two very different viewpoints that you think is true, but both are in fact right. <laughs> Uh, hopefully you've enjoyed this one. Hopefully it's made you see things in a different light. And I'm sure I'll speak to you again very soon. Thanks for listening.